So um, let me make a quick video because I had a mistake in my uh, Excel sheet and uh, I want to set the record straight. So uh, I just took the time to just put it all neatly together and make this quick video. So uh, let's have a look. Um, let me start here at the top. And that is uh, the price of CASPA as seen at coin market coin market cap well when i made the screenshot it differed a little bit but i have it here so this is the starting price in usd then we are looking we will use it as an input then we have this here the current pricing which we get from the bot and the floor price is the cheapest price and what we see because it's ordered from the cheapest average to the more expensive this is the floor price and we see here 5 million crap tokens that's the same as we see here they are offered against the price for 1600 caspa that's what we see here and that if you divide them by each other you get a price that you can see here let me show you the calculation and we divide the caspa amount by the amount of crap tokens and then we get 0 0.00032 caspa per crap but we also want to know uh, what the price is in us dollars so we um, multiply the price that is uh, uh, the price for caspa times the caspa price per crap and then we get the usd price per crap and that is 0 0.00005 usd per crap then we want to um, check out two different calculations and that is what we are calling the uh, fully diluted value and the market market cap and the uh, fully diluted value is the total price for the total supply then so the hundred percent of the tokens well we know that there are 69 billion tokens in total so that we put in um, the price in caspa that we calculated to see the floor price multiplied by the total amount of tokens so that is 22 million caspa then we want to calculate it into us dollars so we again take the total amount of crap tokens and we multiply that with the actual usd price per crap and then uh, uh, let me see it should be like this so the 3.6 million dollars in usd that is the price and uh, well this and we call it the fully diluted value uh, but we can also uh, calculate the market cap and for that we take the amount of crap tokens that are in circulation as the 55 percent of the public sale so like this because it is really simple here we just do the total amount of the supply we multiply it by 55 percent or like 0 0.55 that's the same so about 38 billion crap tokens are in circulation then we multiply the usd times um, the same uh, 55 percent and then we have the market cap in usd and so with this amount of tokens we have this amount money for the mar uh, market cap and then we also have and that is this part here 
uh, the sales target uh, because they want to raise 550,000 cash bar. So that we have here. Then we do a calculation, how much is that worth in US dollars? And of course, then we do the 550,000 cash bar. We multiply it with uh, 16 and a half cents and it is 91,000 USD. Then we are here with the sales price. So that was what the people were paying who had uh, participated in the one minute uh, sale of uh, crap. So they paid 0 0.000024 per crap, but the current price, we already calculated that, that is 0 0.0005. And then to see what the multiplier is that they currently have, then we divide the current price by the price they bought it for during the public sale. And that means that the crap tokens are being sold currently after two and a half hours for a multiplier of a 22. Uh, people often say it's a 22x. So it's 22 times more expensive. So people made a really nice profit <laughs> in two and a half hours, at least those who are able to sell it right now, because there were, when I was uh, watching, uh, and made the screenshot only 77 people uh, or addresses, wallets as a holder. So maybe 70 people got it distributed at that moment. So there was very low liquidity. Um, so my expectation is the more people who will get their tokens distributed, the more people who will make an offer uh, or uh, put their crap for sale because they want to get a part of this 22 multiplier. But people will put in lower prices because the lowest price will be bought. So the price will go down. That is my uh, strong conviction. Uh, so if I were to buy crap, then I would wait until the price would come down a little bit or maybe a lot because I think if I had bought the the, the the crap for this price I would be happy if I can get a 5x in 24 hours and get my initial investment out and still have a lot of crap left to just go along for the ride with no risk at all anymore because I took out my initial capital. So I think there will be a lot of more people who have this same logic and that will make the price go down. So thank you for uh, watching. Uh, sorry for my initial mistake in Excel, but I hope everything is clear. Also the difference between uh, fully diluted uh, value and the market cap and also the multiplier and i hope you have a great evening uh, please subscribe like uh, follow my twitter check out my patreon and see you next time and have a lot of fun with the fantastic crap bye